Oh, look at that guy, Jason. So many late memories of that. <laughs> you know, late night. I just, I had totally forgotten about that thing. I, I, I had totally forgotten about that splash screen. Mm-hmm. Way different than the bright white 360 one. Oh, yeah. Do you think they keep that for the Xbox One? They gotta do something, right? Because that's sort of the, the trend now. You gotta have a splash screen for your console that's, like, iconic. It's different, yeah. You know, the PS3 has one as well. Uh, I think the X, the original Xbox was... Well, I mean, I guess the Dreamcast technically had the exact same one that popped up, but it wasn't built into the console, right? It was part of the... Uh, yeah, they were part of the games because this is obviously the sort of yeah. actual I mean, Xbox I guess if you on really, a hard drive. If you really want to go back, the Sega Genesis was the first one that had the sort of iconic one that we'll see at some point um but of course this is you know loading into an actual operating system exactly um so yeah let's uh we're, we're gonna we're gonna do a sports game today jason mm-hmm. uh this is the evolution of gaming podcast my name is andy and i'm jason and we are here to sort of show you different types of games from different eras uh our goal is to always play on the original hardware so we are playing on an original xbox today and uh, we're going to throw a sports game at you today. Um, sports games are an important part of any console uh, because they, uh, they're, they're yearly. They, they are there literally all the time. Yeah, and of course um, they evolve with consoles as they come along. Yeah, so we're playing ESPN Baseball on the original Xbox. This is one of my favorite baseball games of mm-hmm. all time, Jason. Oh, yeah. Yeah, it's from 2004, I think. Yeah. So, uh, this also, now I, I play, uh, sports games differently than most people, Jason. Yeah, I think we, Uh, I think we both do, actually. Yeah, I don't play the actual sport in the game. Right. I play the season, uh, manager. Yeah. Uh, so I just, I just play the franchise manager where I change... You just, you, know, you just sim the season. Yeah, I just select players. Greetings, everyone, and welcome oh my god, full motion video. <laughs> Major Here we go. I'm Carl Although the, the Xbox One is going back to this. Yes, they are. Doing like TV shows mixed with games. So mm-hmm. ado, that jacket is huge. Right yeah. Game. Of course, yeah. the iconic ESPN baseball theme. Yep, we're going to suit for this. Yep. <laughs> Cease and desist notice. I can feel it I don't now. even know if I ever watched this video. I think I'm just like, just give it to me now, and I just hit start. Yeah. It's Ichiro. Okay. Yeah, these are still some... Th- these these guys no longer play for any of these teams. Yeah, exactly. Wow. Yeah. This is not the actual game, by the way. Like, yes. This is... <laughs> it doesn't look this good. All right. I'm just going to skip past this. Yeah. And um, you might actually run into some saved games on here. Yeah. Who knows? Because this has a hard drive, and exactly, it might might have lasted. Who Your knows? Xbox. Oh God, Jason Giambi is just staring at me. <laughs> That's scary, it's actually. A drug deal gone bad. I know. <laughs> um, so this is technically part of the 2K series. Yeah. Um, the 2K series. We'll go deep into the 2K series because I want to play some 2K uh, NFL 2K mm-hmm. on Dreamcast. We'll get to there there eventually, but uh, this is technically the 2K4. Uh, version. This might have been the only year where they just went with ESPN baseball. Yeah. So got, you've got game modes. You've got to see if there's a there's something saved on here. All right. Um, I don't know where it would be. Load game. Oh, my gosh. You've got a lot of stuff on here. <laughs> and you never reset the date on your console no. either. No, I didn't. That's amazing. Yeah, so look at all these. You've played hours on all those. Mm-hmm. Like that one time... An hour and thirty-two minutes. This one's I don't know if, fifty-nine. Minutes. I don't know if that's that. Surely isn't surely isn't right. Yeah, I don't. I, I can't imagine. Maybe that was no. That couldn't be the time that it was. Maybe the last saved. session that I played. Maybe so. Yeah, that might have, that might be it. Who knows? But anyways, there's a ton of saved games there. So I have played this game. There's my evidence right now because this this is my console we're playing on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is Jason's old console. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna play with my favorite team. I'm going to play real fast here. We're going to play with the Reds if I can find them. Of course, yeah, those you have all sorts 100, of... 100 teams are real easy to play with sometimes. Yeah, and, and that, well, yeah, they I'm, had the international teams. You could do different jerseys on this, I'm pretty sure. You, you could customize a lot of things in this game. Yep. Um, so I'm going to change these guys to something else. Uh, let's do the Blue Jays. Well, and you can change their uniforms too. So hit the uh, left or right um, directional pad, I think. Or something. Yeah, there we go. go. There you go. 
Yeah, so you could change their... Oh, wow. Yeah, I, did, I don't know if I ever realized this. Yeah, you could just change everything about this game, which is great. Not quite, you know, soccer, sim. I'm going with the old... 50, oh, those are <sighs> Those are weird. awful. Yeah, I'm going with those. Yeah. All right. So let's go ahead and uh, go for this. Uh, man, Barry Larkin was still playing. King Griffey Jr. Yep. Austin Kearns, Adam Dunn. Wow. Yeah. Um, so I'm just going to go with this, and I don't really remember how to play this game. Well, you'll find out. And I don't know what the graphics on this look like. I have no idea. They were okay. They were decent. Yeah. Um, we're playing... This is the S controller, correct, Jason? It's the one that came with my system, so. Okay, so I never played on the S controller, the Xbox. I played on the original one, which uh, people hated. Uh, but I liked it for some reason. I don't yeah, know Yeah, I got this Xbox a little bit later than everyone else. It may yeah. have been, like, the second Christmas it was out. Yeah, when well, I... Those aren't bad graphics. Those are okay. I mean, they're not great, but for 2004, I think they're... Hello, everyone. Among... This is John Miller, along with okay, well, the facial stuff faces is are a little pretty bright, bad. But... Now, Rex, as we're just about ready to get started, what do you think of the Okay, movie? I'm not that concerned with you guys seeing the baseball stuff, because they just tried to make it sound like people were actually calling a baseball game. Yeah, which they, you know, it's, then, it's not then, bad. We'll step in and we're baseball, you know, yeah. it's kind of... So I'm going to guess it had a swing That here. was the other thing, too, is there it did go. the schedule things on First the bottom of the screen. Comes. Which was really cool. So, like, it, it updates the scores and stuff, just like if you're watching ESPN. Exactly. So, it's really cool. I mean, they, they yeah. tried to really go with the whole ESPN experience. All right. So, so this game, it's... I don't know if they still do this in baseball games, because I don't really play baseball games anymore. Uh, but, uh, nice. So nice! Wow. He almost got that one. Yeah. Um... But this, this has like a, you sort of have to target where you're going to swing. Mm -hmm. um, I assume baseball games still do this, but I have no idea. Well, this was like a, a big, big thing from the previous generation. I think, you know, obviously they've got swing control and stuff like that now. Yeah. Whereas, you know, this one was more of sort of like a point than you, you know, jam it out kind yeah. of thing. Now a swing and a ball hit foul. You know, and the stadiums are rendered pretty well too in this, I thought. Yeah. You know, it, it was... Well, this was atmospheric. Yeah, I mean, at a certain point, they started uh, really trying to make the stadiums look like the real stadiums. Yeah. In the NES era, the Super NES era, they didn't care at no, all. No, no, it's like the same thing every time, just different colored players. And by colored, I mean uniforms, not like <laughs> yeah, their their creed. Yeah, I'm gonna try to steal a base here. I think it's oh no, it's not. I think it's the the white and black buttons sort of help you lead off a little bit. Maybe okay. I'm wrong. I'm not 100 percent. It's been a minute, obviously. Yeah. Here's the three and one pitch. Ooh. Ooh. We tried to muscle up that time, but and it, you know, it shows you where all the old pitches were and stuff. I mean, it's just yeah, it was a really cool game. Yeah. We'll play through one inning of each uh, one of yeah. Pitching was each side was, here was pretty fun too. Yeah, I mean, I remember having so much fun playing the pitching, but. I would lose interest in playing this part of the game really quickly, you know. Mm -hmm. um, nice. nice. And it's in there, base hit. Very cool. If I'm not mistaken, too, you can change uh, hit, hit pause real quick. Okay. Whenever you get a second. Okay. Okay. Um, go to there's replay, so you can do replay. Yeah. But I'm pretty sure there's you can set this to be different camera controls. So uh, hit pause again real quick. Yeah. Go to options, presentation. You can change the presentation so like ah, okay. you can control everything about it. Yeah. Which is pretty cool. And then the cameras you can do like nice. you can do all this like really crazy first person baseball. Let's try this. Yeah. I have no idea. I have yeah. no idea what's about to happen. But wait, did I actually save? It did. Okay, good. Yeah. Oh, this is weird. <laughs> right? <laughs> I have no idea how to control yeah. this. None yeah. whatsoever. It's just, it's like you can do, the presentation on it was just nuts. And All he right. just looks super close. Oh, nice. Oh, well. Yeah, he got, he got Didn't out work on that. Out. But how weird is that? Like, yeah. I never remember that being in any game before. I or really yeah. remember seeing it since because maybe well, people just. It's a weird way it. to control a video game. Yeah. You know, it's like. We'll see what Ken Griffey Jr. here can do. He looks a little bit like Griffey. You yeah, know? I would say so. Because he's one of the. 
Ooh. Oh, double play. Yeah, that's no Ouch. good. Ouch. This camera control sucks. Yeah. Well, we're going to blame it on the camera control, not Andy. Yeah. Well, I, I won't pretend I'm good at this game yeah. regardless, but... Well, you can't really, quote-unquote, cheat that way. Like, can't, you can't really sort of place where you want the bat to swing at. Yeah. So the way I remember this working is you sort of target an area now, I don't and then know you if can... The, I don't know if the pitching's in first person now either. It is. It is, okay. Yeah. And this one's not too bad. Yeah. But you may want to switch out yeah, to the yeah, other yeah, one. Yeah, I think I will. But that is just something I wanted to, like, blow your mind with because... I think you would have referenced it. You w would have referenced it previous yeah. to today, but yeah, I think it goes back to the, just the default. Yeah. Um, okay. So you need to choose your pitch. Then you need a place where it is. Hold it there. Yeah. So, know, so no I'm, I'm sort of moving my cursor a little bit and then it snaps back. Yeah. So I'm going to, I don't I mean, even know however what... much effort you're going to put behind it. It's kind of the heat. The so if you sort of hold it down, I'm pretty sure it increases your, yeah. Changing speeds for a pitcher is such a key. All right, so I'm going to do a fastball. Yeah, nice. Throw it as hard as I possibly can. And There's a swing and, a ground and you control the, the fielders, too. Yeah. And I'm pretty sure maybe you could do auto those. I think maybe you could have the, the auto field. Yeah, yeah, perhaps. yeah. I think so. That was a lot of fun, Ooh, too. Oh, Adam Dunn does not look good. Yeah, well. <laughs> it has the background music, too. It's fun. All right, so a slider should sort of move in a certain direction maybe towards him a little bit yeah it'll kind of kind of yeah. move away at the same time let's do a sinker here no those are fun Ooh. Ooh. here's a swing and a fly ball Ooh. Right and all the way to the warning track in there. all right very nice all right. Well, this is a pretty good pitch to hit and he gets good wood on this good wood now he's in not right. like some good wood on that Now, I believe you also have to deal with, like, pitcher's fatigue and stuff mm -hmm. as well. Yeah. So there's managing in the game as well, not only just sort of simming the whole season like we tended to do. Yeah. And every now and then what would I what I would do is, you know, I would sim a certain part of the season like, oh, man, there's like this two weeks is just, you know, going to be awful. Yeah. You know, and his see, so now his, uh, his confidence increases too there. Which yeah. is pretty cool, so he'll pitch a lot better. Yeah. But basically what I would do is I, you know, would start, you know, a franchise, run the season, I'd be like, I don't really want to play these two weeks of games. But I knew a really, like, important game was coming up. Or I'd sort of watch the win-loss and kind of see where I wanted to place myself. Because sometimes you do want to place yourself against another team and, and kind of purposely lose. Yeah. We'll just say that. So I would, you know, sim the actual game or play the actual game. Ooh, get it, 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 get it. Nice. Got him. And then play the actual game to determine whether I wanted to, you know, win or lose. Yeah. To keep it, you know, important. Um, you know, I'd get to, like, the playoffs, and I'd play the World Series. I'd actually sit there and play the actual, sure, 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 you know, sure. games. And see, so you could yeah. sim to the end of the game. Let's just get to the end of the game, see what happens. Which is awesome. Take its time, and I, I won. And see, it has shortened uh, yes. innings because you only played four there. Yep. You know, so that's a setting that you could do, too. I was just wanting to, like, I didn't want to sit there and do nine innings every yep. time. So you can change that off. So, yeah. So I, I'm i going to do the GM career real quick here. Fantasy draft. Uh, Serpentine. 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 Sure, why not? League budgets was always also a big thing, of course, because, you know, the Yankees have all the money. Yeah. You could trade with the, C, you know, the CPU. Yeah, definitely want that. All fictional players. See, this is kind of interesting. Well, so you could actually turn off the real players. Which... I bet there's a lot of seasons if you were to open up one of those those leagues that I was totally I, kicking know, ass. Yeah. Well, I know. I know for a fact. I played through enough seasons on this game that eventually all the players that you know who they are, they're gone because yeah. they have retired. Yeah. Um, and you could change the playoff format, like which is great. You know, like if you hate playing seven full games. Yep. Or five full games early. All right, I'm gonna go with this. And that you could you can manage the miners, like you could bring guys up. It's great. I'll just be Roger. Sure. Roger, Roger Weber. Weber. There we go. All right, and this is what's cool about it. You can. Uh, you can get you can get hired. Yeah. So if I want to work for the Reds, which is my favorite team, you know, I can I can work for them. And your or, projected income was only three eighteen. Yeah, but if I want more money, I can go work for somebody else like well the, the Braves. Braves I think I randomized all these so yeah. it's not the the actual amount of money sure but uh yeah let's go with somebody with a lot of money 
uh, somebody who's anachronistic here. Wow, the twins, twins with five hundred thirty-seven. Sure, great, perfect. You see, Senior now contract at fifteen yeah. BP. I don't even know what that means. Uh, for sure, bonus, bonus baseball points. points. Or it's they, they're for something. I can't remember. Okay, so. Yes. So you actually have to hire your coaches too. Yeah, which is awesome. So I'm looking for a batting coach. And he has a certain cost, and you can get him for a certain number of years. So, of course, you don't want a batting coach with an F grade. Yes, exactly. Um, it looks like I lost. I, I'm, you know, I don't know much about these guys, so I'm going to go with somebody at the B level. Um, we'll go with the three-year guy here. Car Chris Franklin, sure, why not? Yes. And you can fire coaches. Exactly. So I need a pitching coach. Um, I need a minor league manager and a scout and a manager. So, uh, yeah. So I'm, I'm looking for – let's do a manager here. I like Seamus. Seamus O'Neill. Well, he's got a D-minus in batting. Ah. <laughs> let's find somebody at least a little balanced. Guts Gottberg. Good enough. He'll only work for us for a year, but uh, – Hey, he's you got know. he's got a he's got a comeuppance. Yes, yeah, so we better get a pitching coach before these guys are all gone. Chuckles McCoy, good, Chuckles McCoy, <laughs> that's awesome. Uh, uh, Philip I Spooner, <laughs> uh, minor league man. for sure. Why not? I've never noticed how awful these names are. I know, me neither. Red Shatsky. Wow, uh, I'm gonna go with the guy with a C plus and a, a C and a C, C and a C. Sure, Marcus Monet, the French guy. Uh, and then I just need a scout. Let's just go with that guy. And I believe as you go, you'll you mm -hmm. know, you'll be able to uh, to kind of make this work. So, yeah. It, wow, Albert Pujols was still the guy at that point. Well, I mean, um, he's got a hundred percent rating. We're gonna take him. Um, what am I supposed to be doing here? Uh, well, you got You're you're doing the. You're you're hot. You're you're doing your players now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure, Joe Young. Uh, Barry Zito, wow. That's appropriate. Yeah. Uh, yeah, starting pitcher, sure, why not? Well, if you hit Y and you can kind of see what's going on here. Yeah. So that's kind of your, you know. Who have I already drafted? Okay. Yeah. Let's see if you auto-draft for you as well. Is mm -hmm. um, Sammy Sosa. Ooh. Yeah, so, yeah, so you can kind of see where you are. Yeah, I don't know what that first screen was, though. Was that just somebody else's which, draft? Which one? The first screen I saw that I got to hear. Oh, I don't know. I wasn't paying that much okay. attention. But as you can see, you've got your BP remaining is sort of your yeah. amount of... Okay, so this is somebody else's draft. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So no, no, this is, yeah, this is the draft summary, so you're at the end of it. Oh, Ichiro. You know. We're always taking Ichiro. Yeah, it'd be crazy not to. Uh, I'll take Jeter. <laughs> So yeah, it's just doing you know, almost like a fantasy football so situation. Yeah, I need some pitching here. Yeah, you gotta Let's get, get some. Uh... And what are you doing to switch back and forth? Is uh, it the triggers? Let, let triggers, yeah. All right, let's take uh, Chris Schilling here. I don't know. He's got a bloody ankle. That's true. That ketchup ankle of his. All right, so uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get another good pitcher. Greg Maddox. Wow. He's got good stamina. That's good. Yep. But now I'm basically out of money. That's true. Um, no, that's not what I want to do. Uh, yeah. So I'm gonna go ahead. Well, you gotta have at least two decent pitchers, and then everybody yeah. else can kind of just be. Yeah. So I think I've know. got all, all my stars. I'm gonna let the computer auto draft for me. Finish it up. I'm gonna have to check out your roster once this is all done. Yep. See what familiar names are on there. Hopefully, no more Chuckles McCoys or. <laughs> if I could just make a team of Chuckles McCoys, you that's can, what actually. I would do. You can actually implant your own players in this game. That's awesome. All right, let's 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 see what your team looks like. Show you his goals for the team. Limit your spending to 537 BP. Improve the team by increasing our team's power rating wow. to 92. Preston Wilson is overpaid, and it's about time. Mm. We, we literally just drafted him. Yeah, <laughs> we well. We literally just drafted him. Um, no, um, it'd be under uh, manager, manager, and then your. I've got Ichiro. I've got Jeter. I've got uh, Jay Young. I don't know who that is. P. Wilson, Jeff Kent, Durazo, Blum, Clark. Estrada. Estrada. I don't know who any of those other guys are. Um, who else do I have pitching? Um, no one really known, uh, except for the guys I got earlier. So, yeah. Um, okay, well, so... We'll go to your team summary, actually. And so that'll kind of tell you... Yeah. This, this is the other thing, too. So it's like, as you work on it, 
Yeah, and what what I like to do for this, you know, I've I can let's just go through the schedule here, and I can sim uh too few healthy batters on your roster. Yes, go they all, for it. They all they all went drinking the night before, apparently. Yeah, exactly. So yeah, so I'm just gonna sim through the first month. Then you get like you can actually watch a game cast of a game and not control it. Exactly. Which honestly is what I would used to do. Like uh, if I'm like, like I want to eat lunch, but I still want to keep playing the game. I would just sit there and literally watch a game while I made a sandwich. Yeah, see, and it just pops up and is like, hey, by the way, Derek Jeter's got injured. He's out for six days. There isn't the sort of old yeller option that I wish was yeah. in here, but it's all right. Yeah. Just shoot him. Just yeah. shoot him. <laughs> yeah, so you can like stop the sim and adjust your lineup and yeah. stuff or automatically do it. I mean, it yep. just was such a deep... So it's like you can Fantasy. be the GM and just be like, I just want to hire a guy that does a thing and then like see where we're at. So yeah. it's like, okay, what are what are we what are we looking at right now? So I, I can go to team standings here. I'm in second place. I'm two games back. Uh, so I can go into the manager here. I can I can look at this and uh, look at my contracts and say, okay, who's who's I'm, I'm negative two right now. So who's making a lot of money and who can I? fire uh, i can go to the miners and call up guys from the yeah. miners there's just all sorts of cool stuff you can do um this is just one of the best franchise modes i've ever played in a game i literally jason probably played 25 seasons of this yeah I wouldn't, my, I... my old roommate would literally would just walk out of his room and like i'd just be sitting there just like watching like this screen and just like oh i'm almost there i can i can almost make it to the next thing it's like oh let's do the next two months and he would just have no idea what the hell was going right. on right I don't, I mean... So, yeah, I mean... I don't blame you. I mean, th this is clearly something we have in, in common. Yeah. Because I... I just, I didn't really love... Let's see. Strain One triceps. Day. And if you don't want to see any of that stuff, you could just turn on the injuries, you know? Let yeah, the let the CPU it. manage all injuries. I don't care. As far as I'm concerned, that's a... Uh, um, the auto-adjustment of lineups. Yeah, you're the manager. Do your job. Right. You know? And the prospects. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, okay, so prospect. Let's yeah, try you to want sign him. Guy. Yes. Salary's low. Oh. And then you lose guys, and it's like, that's sad. And then you try to get them back by trading. Exactly. Exactly. So, yeah. So, now I'm in third place. So, now I could go back and, you know, make adjustments and, uh, you know, figure all this stuff out with my budget. And it's like... Projected expenses. I'm too over my projected expenses. So I could fix that by, you know, literally just dropping somebody yeah. who's making money. And I could just... who Who's making how much money and just cut them just for funds. Funsies. So I've got three catchers. Do I need three catchers? No. I don't think I do. Uh, so I could just... Uh, oops. I could yeah, just release need... that guy. Cost of zero BPs. Sure. Um, looks like I'm still low, but oh well. Yeah. Anyways, you guys get the idea. Um, we're pretty close on time, Jason, so let's, uh, let's kind of get out of here. There is, uh, there's so much more to do in this game, but, uh, the point of this series, this podcast, is not to play every game perfectly or play through everything, uh... It is a little bit about nostalgia. Yeah, exactly. Just going back and telling you guys stories and sort of telling you what we played growing up. You yep. know, I, like I said, I wasted many a many an hour just simming through this whole oh, thing. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. And the presentation is really solid. I mean, e yeah. the ESPN really tried to make a game that looked like ESPN baseball. So, like, you turn on the TV, and this is what you would see. Exactly. And they did. I thought they did a really good job of it. Like I said, the the scroller thing on the bottom was brilliant. Yeah. The GMB thing. Well, and that's something that a not lot so of much. yeah. <laughs> That's something that a lot of uh, games have now co-opted, like the scroll at the bottom of the screen to make right. it look like a real sporting event or whatever. Um, oh, and I create your own player. Yeah, that's what I would do. I bet you. Let's let's see if any of your your you've got any of your saved. Uh, I want to say you could even change the way they looked. Let's see, you don't have any saved players. Mm. Let's do this real quick before we get out of here because I think you can change the way they look, and it's amazing. Yeah. Like, you could just make, like, a really, really, like, chronically skinny player. Or yeah. you could make them, like, severely overweight. <laughs> Which, these days, is pretty common. Yeah. 
It doesn't look like it's changing. Well, hold his on a second. Look. Just when when you, it's got a it's got a ring. Ah, his build. Yeah. Heavy. Age. Let's make him old. He's <laughs> just an old fat guy. That's yeah, I think you can go to forty. Forty-five. Forty-five. Yeah. Uh, he throws left and bats right. Let's just make him super tall. Tall the baseball the bat doesn't even know what to do. Look at that. <laughs> he's, he's so big, he has to hold it in the middle. He is going to be a shortstop because that's that makes sense. And, yeah, you can implant this player into the draft and draft yourself. Exactly. Which is amazing. Oh, and I can change his batting stance. Yeah, stands. you can change everything. Yeah, let's do that. Yep, we can change his head around. Definitely need the mustache. Change his uniform style. I mean, you could just create a whole... I'm pretty sure, like, every friend of mine was on my baseball team at one point. Oh, yeah. Shin guard, no shin guard, yeah. Socks. Hello. Yeah, I mean, this is nuts. Um, I, I don't know if... I, I imagine baseball games nowadays do something along these lines, but I, I haven't played so. a baseball game in a while, yeah, so... Yeah, I haven't either. But, uh, anyways, you guys get the idea. This is some fun, and I can just boost his stats <laughs> yeah you can make him the best player in the league yep. and there's no yeah how good is he at getting doubles or <laughs> whatever you don't have to make him balanced at all you no just you make don't. him as crazy as you want that's kind of fun just how patient you are with hitting those buttons yeah, it's like how deep does the rabbit hole go yeah yeah i mean this is nuts yeah, yeah. so anyways a lot of fun sports games. We will play more sports games as we go because they're an important part of the evolution of gaming. Yeah, that's true. So, uh, but uh, we'll, we'll try to sprinkle them in, Jason, because I know it's very tempting. There's when we're trying to keep this podcast cheap, so we don't have to buy a lot of new games. Sports games are always cheap. Oh yeah, there's so many always. of them. Uh, and as soon as and they're 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 yearly. So as soon as you buy one, it's worth nothing. Yep. <laughs> so. Uh, Anyways, uh, we're going to get out of here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Uh, I'm Andy. And I'm Jason. We'll see you next time.